The biggest challenge that BTS has always faced is to reorient ourselves so that we look like a traditional residential bricks and mortar focused seminary. But that wasn't the founding vision. The founding vision was to extend seminary education. So ever since 1972, BTS has remained committed to taking education as it would appear in a traditional seminary and then continuing to push the boundaries of where we can send that education. One of the ways that BTS looks different than a traditional seminary model is that the average age of the BTS student is 39 years old. So the BTS student is fully engaged in ministry while they're taking classes at the seminary. So we have pastors, we have counselors, we have not-for-profit leaders, we have church members, Sunday school teachers. Students from BTS are doing all kinds of things around the world. I was not necessarily planning on getting a seminary degree. I just would choose Birmingham Theological Seminary classes that I was the most interested in that I thought could help me develop the most in my personal ministry. I initially started it because I had been called to a church, had no theological education, but knew I needed it in order to lead them. So between having my first child, doing my first job, and having my first church, BTS came in and just sort of helped me to understand what it meant to be a qualified minister and to be a studied minister that could rightfully divide the word of truth. I think those things are critical if you're going to be effective in ministry. This is brilliant, in my opinion. When you take a class on minor prophets from a great professor, and then you get to go to your Sunday school class and teach on the minor prophets, you're going to learn a lot more in how to implement it in life and practice than if you just take the classroom and write a paper. The thing that I learned here at BTS, I have implemented them into my, in my, into my ministry. One of the class was Greek in the Hebrew class. And so I started teaching it in my Bible studies. And then when people got an opportunity in the church to speak, they started saying, in the Greek this mean, in the Hebrew this mean. My time with BTS has been a time of theological excellence, but it's also been a time of learning practical personal ministry, learning how to meet with people, learning how to teach classes, learning how to pray, and learning how to personally share my faith. The heart of BTS is first and foremost to be faithful. Faithful to the Word of God, to the sufficiency of Scripture, to knowing we serve a sovereign Lord. The second component of the heart of BTS is accessibility. We're affordable, we're flexible. We work with students to help them achieve goals. This isn't our journey. It's your journey for serving the Lord. It's your journey that God has called you to. We serve you best by being faithful and by being accessible. The heart of BTS is to provide quality, reformed theological education, faithfully and accessibly, so that we can serve the local church by building leaders for his kingdom.